Canadian authorities are investigating an outdoor adventure company for allegedly slaughtering about 100 sled dogs after the 2010 Winter Olympics. He could have always said no. Nobody forced him to slit those dogs' throats, shoot them multiple times, create a mass grave. I'm sorry, that is... Uh, just not an excuse. Documents say some of the animals were maimed and left writhing in pain. One dog reportedly tried to run away with her face blown off and an eye hanging out. We think as the public uh, finds out more of the, the details of this case that they're going to be completely outraged. The Royal Canadian Mounted Police and local animal rights organizations are investigating the incident. The name of the man who allegedly killed the dogs has not been released, but at least one of the company's employees was awarded a workers' compensation claim after the incident. Documents reveal that company sales dropped off after the Vancouver Games. When homes for its animals could not be found, the company allegedly ordered the killing. We would certainly like to see these people prosecuted and subject to criminal uh, charges if the evidence uh, warrants those charges, and it looks like uh, it does. Uh, but beyond that, we'd like to see uh, the entire sled dog industry shut down so that something like this can never happen again. The banning of it would certainly impinge upon people that have legitimate businesses that are doing things properly and caring for their animals in a responsible and proactive way. The investigation is ongoing. If convicted, the man who was accused of killing the dogs could face anywhere from six months to five years in prison in addition to a fine. Diane Kepley, The Associated Press.